Well, our defense the last seven minutes was terrific. Um, we turned them over. Uh, we pressed them. We bothered them. We scrambled, which was terrific to see. Quentin, you know, I, I talked in the locker room about this. Like, he is your perfect example of last year. And this doesn't always happen. He trusts the coach. I said, Q, I don't want to waste your eligibility. I really love your potential. Uh, I just don't know how much you're going to play. He said, whatever you think, coach, which is shocking. Um, then this year, he never said, I want to play the two. I want to play the three. I want to play the four. Never asked, never said anything. Just continues to punch the clock. And then ready to perform when he's put in the game. So it's great to see. He's, he's making me think of decisions and think of ways to put him in. Uh, the press was terrific in the second half. We did a great job. They forced a lot of turnovers at Arizona, 20-plus, uh, and we only turned the ball over seven times. We were way better in the second half at running our offense, cutting. Um, deflections were great, 40-plus, which is terrific. We know what our weaknesses is. Th those two exhibition games were great. We got to guard the ball better. We've got to rebound the ball better as well. Um, and so it was good because – and it was great again. It was similar to the last game. We thought Highlands would be a good team, but it was great in the sense of we were in a close game, and we, we need that because although we are experienced, there's a lot of new guys out there who have never played in the pit, at, which is indicative of 11 missed free throws. Um, so really good win, a lot of good uh, film that we will see, build off of, and get ready for Monday. I don't know if the uh, them together numbers were the plus minus, but you did try, and you said you were going to, JT and Nelly on the floor together a little bit, an awfully big lineup to start. Um, it didn't look like it was working very well. I know. It was the first did you see the start, 12-2? to two? No, I think it, you know, it, it, it certainly started good, but, yeah, I don't know if it was great. Um, and maybe it's the opponent in the sense that they're playing small guards and they're taking you off the bounce. Mustafa's never going to be a great defender. That's just he's not laterally that quick. So when you're putting him on a guard, maybe not as good. But I still like the option. I challenged JT. I think he had one rebound at halftime, I believe. Um, and he finished with eight, which was great. We still got to remember Nelly's practice like three times. Um, so – I still think it could be valuable. Um, is it quite ready to be phenomenal? No. Um, I do know, I, I mean, I watch St. Mary's and they got some big dudes, so maybe that's something in two games we can look at. So I'm trying to do a bunch of different things. Um, so it's a work in progress for sure. I know you mentioned Q and, and Q mentioned the same thing when he was up here talking, wanting to, to make it hard on you to, to figure out how to play him. If he's playing that well, you're – you're going to have to play him. I can't imagine coming into the season, he was a guy, though, that you probably thought you were going to be playing all that much. Is, is that fair? Yeah, I mean, it's – you kind of have in your head what you think the rotation may be. Um, you know, as I said before, we have 14 guys. We have – 12 scholarship guys, two walk-ons. The walk-ons think they should play. Everybody thinks they should play. A lot of people say that's a good problem to have or it's hard for you. It's not hard for me. That's, that's hard for them, which is great. That's what we're trying to simulate is competing at the highest level possible and believing in the program of developing and pushing each other in practice. Um, Q has played two exhibition games and not real games, and he's impressed me. Um, and that's why I went back to him in the second half. Um, his, it's never a question of attitude. Attitude is amazing. What's been nice to see is hitting some shots, rebounding the basketball, getting some steals. So um, two exhibition games. They're not real games, uh, but I have been uh, certainly very, very impressed. Coach, this was just an exhibition game, but in these last two games, it seems like you guys are just trying to get into things, and in the second half is where things really start to flow. On the, on the season opener, how are you going to make sure your team comes out out the gates? Well, we did come out of the gates. We then took our foot off the gas. We were terrific at the beginning of the game. Um, and then that middle part of the first half, we weren't as good. Um, we had a big lead, and then we let them come back. I subbed a little bit, so I'll have to look at, is it, is it something that we're doing rotation-wise? Um, I don't really care how we start, how we play in the middle, or how we finish. I care about over 40 minutes, how did we play? And I would think both games we did a lot of good things um, especially for two guys who potentially are going to start out Nelly Jr. Joseph just getting in last week so uh, it, it's a it's a long game it's a long season uh, I care about the result and there's been certainly a lot of good things can you give us an official update on Baker and how he did play 
he had a uh, knee kind of swell up deal. Uh, so we gave him a couple days off practice. And uh, I expect him to practice on Friday and be back. It's nothing serious, but he's had a lot of injuries in the past. So he had a little swelling, and we just wanted to be cautious. So we feel like uh, Jalen, Isaac, and Jamal will all start to return to play. We'll take off tomorrow, and then we'll all bring them back in, hopefully with the intent of being ready by Monday. Do you have a Bobby Knight story? The only one I have is um, – when I won the NIT my first year, he was uh, still doing TV um, with, I think, Coach Frischilla and him. And uh, I was lucky enough to get to speak to him before the games, like at those shoot-arounds and things like that. And he was, he was great to me. I know his son a little bit better, obviously, than him. Um, my dad had some wars with him uh, at Indiana, Kentucky. Um, those were some good battles. So, obviously, uh, he's got a unique way of doing it, but he's an all-time great um, and we're praying for him and his family. Is your dad, did he ever say anything? That... Um, nothing specific that I know of. Uh, I didn't talk to him today. Do you remember that Guitar Hero uh, cart? Or... I remember that commercial, yeah. So I'm on, a group, I'm on a group text with our family, and that commercial was sent. And so I had a good chuckle about that. Anything else for Coach? Uh, just a quick uh, update on, you, you mentioned he's only been here three games, but what do you think of Nelly tonight? Yeah, I still, I still, I'm pretty impressed by what he's doing, to be honest with you. I wanted to try to extend his minutes. I think he played 16 in the first, played 26 in the second, which is great. Wish he would have blocked maybe one or two more, but I think it's pretty darn impressive what he's doing. What we don't have right now is this true understanding of when to throw him the ball in the post, where Morris, we had that, but that was months of practice. So um, we'll work our best to – we got a, one or two things in that we throw him to the post. Uh, we've tried to save some, but uh, we got to establish that. First half, we were shooting so many threes. We got to go inside, inside out. We were really good at that last year. So um, absolutely um, – really hard what he's done and it's been pretty impressive. I know you said you wanted to be better at threes after that first game and you did hit your first three tonight. First three shots were all threes, but 17 three-pointers in the first half probably more than Yeah, I I I looked at the box score. I think it was 17 to 27 were threes and I said, but that again comes to we don't have a lot in for Nelly to throw it in there yet. We don't have a lot for JT to play him at the four and throw it in yet just cuz he wasn't here. Nell, Nelly wasn't here. So there's things we can maybe add, but I don't want to run a lot of our stuff right now. Um, but I definitely thought the first half, we were jacking up threes. We made a couple early instead of even attacking the rim. Second half, we got some back cuts. We were playing way more offensively the way we're trying to play.